Alright, welcome back to UWA WWE 13 with our next tournament action. Well, actually, we're going to do the women's uh, match now. Going to do a tag team match. Going to be the women. Uh, yes. Alright, it's going to be. If I can find them. Portia Perez. And Nicole Matthews. Okay, load. Thank. Can I? Can I go? Thank you. Against Alicia Fox and Kelly Kelly's ugly ass. The two manly looking women of the team. So yeah, we're good. All right. That looks weird. I don't remember WrestleMania looking like that when. But whatever. All right, UWA. And play. All right, so the Canadian then just taking on Kelly Kelly and Alicia Fox. My fat ass is falling out of my chair. Here we go. Of course, the Canadian Ninjas are the number one contenders for the women's tag team titles. And at the end of this uh, this tour, slash, yeah, that's what I'm going I'm to start doing tours. And I'll explain that in the next video. Ah, uh, no more universe mode for a little while, but we're going to do tours. It's going to be about seven shows per tour. The first and last show of the tour will be like the big, the big, you know, the big matches. Like the first show will have like junior heavyweight and tag title matches. And then the last uh, show of the tour will have the heavyweight the TV, the national, and the women's, so forth and so on. It's almost going to be like a Japanese style of way of booking. Uh, but yeah, so that's how that's going to be. Uh, I'll go more deep into it when I do my unboxing video for Tomb Raider. Uh, oh, crap. Hey, come on now. Get off me. You don't treat Portia like this, goddammit. Is she going to do anything else besides stomp? There we go. I've been watching a ton of Japanese wrestling lately, so that's what made me want to try this. And then I'll take, like, maybe a little while off from the game. And then I'll be able to, uh, you know, stay fresh with it and not kill everybody with it. You know, because for a while there, that's all I was uploading. So, you know, I'll do, like, two weeks of... UWA and WWE 13 take a week off play Walking Dead Tomb Raider because Walking Dead and Gears of War come out on Tuesday next Tuesday so I'm going to be doing at least one of those for a week come back with more UWA new new matches etc so yes, I think that would be pretty cool. But I'll go into that in more detail later on. Uh, right now, though, Portia Perez is kicking Alicia Fox's ass. And looks like Alicia's going to make a tag now. And I'll make a tag as well. Nicole Matthews, former ECCW Tag Team Champions. But they lost it this past weekend to uh, Scotty Mack and Jamie Diaz. Of the administration. Not too happy about that. But Alex Plexus caused them to lose the belt. Their own tag partner. So there's going to be a split up of the ri the riot. Coming up. Wouldn't surprise me to see Nicole Matthews go back to being a heel. Um, if you haven't seen ECCW. Check them out. They're really fucking good. They're like the only Canadian group I know who runs like almost every weekend. They might And they run in... Tiny little buildings too, like friggin' look like my bedroom. One of them, it was so small. I like, it literally could have been like someone's living room. It was that hilarious. Some drop kicks there. Kelly Kelly's not faring too well here. What the hell? Oh God! Some English lady was talking to me again. Why does that always happen during my videos? There we go. Reversal. Get the fuck off the apron, you ugly ass woman. 
All right, Irish whoop to the corner. No, not that corner, you idiot. What are you doing? Can't even run in the right direction. You're so stupid. There we go. Make the tag to Porsche and get some tag moves going on in here. Hey, go for the pin. What are you doing? Why didn't you go for the pin? Why didn't you let her... Oh, that you stupid fucker. Charles Robinson, you. I have not missed you at all. See what happens. I, th I think you're. I think you're teaming up with Kelly Kelly. Holy crap! I already got a signature, and it is a leaping complete shot. I'll take it. And the super kick. Go for the pin. Go for the pin. Thank you. One, two, three, and the Canadian Ninjas are victorious. Irish whip, and there we go. There's that. Elbow drop. So, at the end of the tour, it will be Portia Perez and Nicole Matthews taking on the Bellas for the UWA Women's Tag Team Titles. People Power! John Laurinaitis. I got the People Power. Yeah. I like people power. Alright, so now, coming up, we're going to go back to A block, or block A, and we're going to have Superstar J take on Santino. And it might, and this is actually going to be for the TV title too. So, if a champion is wrestling, you might get a double title match. So that's going to be kind of awesome. So let's see. I'm getting text. I should probably stop answering my text and worry about my matches here. Okay. Alright, so. Superstar J, we're going to do the yellow gear. And Santino. Alright, so. Block A, five points on the line. As usual. Come on. Alright, UWA television title match. Also, round robin block A match. Superstar J versus Santino. Here we go. One of these days it'll pop up here. Maybe. Come on. Come on. Come on. Also, new Sleeping Dogs DLC came out today. I'll be doing that uh, as well. So, I've got a lot of stuff on my plate. I said I was only going to do three games, but I think I'm going to have to do Sleeping Dogs. Sleeping Dogs is probably only like maybe an hour at the most. I just got to re-remember the controls. Alright, so here's Superstar J. Right now, going on a huge ass television title reign. Still looking good. Damn straight. All right. Now we're moving on over to Santino. We're going to skip his entrance. Alright. There's that crooked ref Charles Robinson showing off the belt. Going to skippy skippy. Alright. Here we go. Ring that bell. Oh crap. I missed that. How the hell did I miss that? Oh, crap. Oh, that's not a good way to start off the match. What the hell? I got a trophy? When the hell did I get a trophy for? Well, that's strange. I'll take it, but it's strange. Big Blue Thunder driver. Can't even get a one count. Ah, <laughs> 
Tilt a whirl side slam. Love it. And what's going to happen here? Arm breaker. Irish whoop into the far side and running Yakuza kick. And a huge ass lariat. He won't stay down. Sell. You're like Davy Richards. Stay the fuck down for a minute. God damn. Okay, I'm getting pissed now. Fucking sell. Shit. There we go. Lift him up for a vertical suplex. Down you go. If you get up before I get over there to do something. Okay. I'm going to work on the leg now. Damn straight. It's a double drop. Yeah, there's maybe about 500 people in this building, Michael Cole. You should have edited that down to uh, the proper... Get up, you son of a bitch. Oh, no, he caught me! Holy shit! That's actually pretty cool. If this wasn't for the belt, I would, uh... Probably would have... And he pinned me, I would have not kicked out. That was such a perfect ending. Go back to work on that leg. And try and hit that half crab. I just can't get over the physicality of this, this has been brutal. Uh -huh. Still sound like a jacked up Mickey Mouse. How was that not hurting him? What the hell was that too? That's all he does? Okay, there we go. I was about to say. An ankle lock, really? No, don't work on the legs, god dang it. And God's last gift. But I don't want to do that though. Pull him out. Figure four. Oh, uh, it's not gonna work, I don't think. Well, it might. Oh, no, he got out of it. Shit, he's going to roll it over. Come on, let me out of it, damn it. There we go. Oh, no, he got out. Oh. Now, how are you even walking, Santino? That's bullshit. There, you got me again, bastard. There we go. Double underhook, belly to belly. belly, to belly Alright. Huge flying clothesline. And making them humble. Come on, you better tap. Yeah, you're going to tap. You're going to tap. He taps. Alright. So that is five points for Superstar J. Zero for Santino. And since this is stock music, I can uh, actually play the music. There's the God's Last Gift. Here's Santino trying to make a comeback. But it, well, he actually did make a comeback there. And there's the Camel Clutch. Made him humble. And he tapped. I break his back and make him humble. And I also retained the TV title. Or Superstar J returned the TV title. Now in his like third month as television champion. Game time I guess you could say. Real time he's like had it for a good couple months. Alright. Let's exit out of that. We're going to go to B block now. We're going to have The Miz taking on Ryback. Now, everybody knows I'm not 
particularly fond of the Ryback. Or should I do Drew McIntyre versus Ryback? I don't know what I want to do. Okay, this is going to take some actually watching and looking. I think I might do Ryback versus Jinder Mahal, actually. And this will be our main event of the evening. Once it comes up here. There we go. Alright, so Ryback. Oh, wait, that's... Alright, so there's Ryback. Let's do... Versus Jinder Mahal. Of course, five points are on the line as usual. And... Windows Media Player just popped up for some reason. Sorry about that. My computer decided today was the day to do updates on every damn thing in the world. Little brother just beat Street Fighter. Good job. Very proud of you, sir. Alright, so Ryback against Jinder Mahal. Like I said, five points are on the line. And any day now. Then after this, I should, uh, my unboxing video of Tomb Raider should be up. And then my Walking Dead video should be up. I believe part 11 is almost done rendering. Uh-oh. He wants to be fed. Gonna feed you boar. Okay, yeah, I get the hell out of here. Looks so weird. He looks like a penis on this game. Alright, where's Jinder? Alright, there's Jinder. Goodbye, Jinder. Alright, here we go. Main event time from Coastal Community College. Gonna be Jinder Mahal taking on Ryback. Five points in play. Of course, the winner of the, like I said, the winner of this tournament will take on Cesaro at the end of the next tour. Holy shit! Irish whip and another one for good measure. Yeah, this isn't gonna last long. Be interesting to see how uh, Daniel. Brian and the Miz do. The Rybacks controlling the arm. Come on. Elbow to the back of the head. The more elbow drops, that'll be perfect for his uh the shell shock. Uh oh. Every time we see Ryback, he gets better and better. What? I didn't even get an opportunity to block that. Oh. That's ass. And did you hear the impact on that kick? There we go. Whee! There's the suplex. Irish whip. And another. Epic boss man slam. Now we got a signature. Gonna be the piggyback stunner. And down he goes. We know what that is. Time for the shell shock. And down he goes. With the pin. Oh no, we got a rope break. That is the only thing that saved Gender. That's not going to save him. One, two, three. All right, so that is five points for Ryback. So he gets five points while Jinder gets Jack.
Alright. Alright, folks. Well, thank you for watching. As usual, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Or else I'll get very mad and uh, be unhappy. You don't want me to be unhappy, do you? I'd hope not. Alright, well, no, seriously, uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter at Bourbon Jimbo, all that fun stuff. And, uh, alright, come back for the next video where we will be at the River Center Exhibition Hall. The world renowned Exhi River Center Exhibition Hall. Not really. Alright, toodaloo!